Oh my good, I am so excited because this set right here, the brand new 151, which is its literal name, just came out in Japan like two days ago, I think. I express shipped it into Australia and we get to open it today. This bad boy comes out in English, I think at the end of September, and we are gonna unbox it today. This thing is so special. Not only does it only feature Pokemon from the original 151, the main character of this thing is a Mew card. Also, this set has like a Charizard, it has Blastoise, has Venusaur, all the classics, but this Mew card right here, it features such a beautiful artwork of the sun literally setting, depending on what angle you hold the card in. Now, before I get 6,000 comments, and oh, where do I buy these Japanese 151 boxes? I'll leave a link to eBay in the description, but please have a scroll through a bunch of listings before you buy anything, just because I think the price of this is gonna be going up and down day by day because of how much hype is behind it. How many people wanna open this set right now? It is ridiculous. Now, this is why it's so cool. Not only does it feature all the Kanto bangers, like look at this, Squirtle on the second card in. The artwork is gonna be sensational by the way. Because they've done like 151 so many times, like they've done these Pokemon again and again, they've really upped the artwork to a point where you're still getting excited. Point number one why we're getting pumped up. These little reverses with the Pokeballs on them, one pack in every single box, just one, is gonna have Master Balls instead of regular Pokeballs. So we're gonna keep our eyes peeled for a Master Ball uh, reverse, which is really special. Marowak, oh my gosh, as our first holo. Then we got Hypno, and then a regular trainer. The other thing we're gonna keep our eyes peeled for, there are God Packs. I don't know what the ratio for a God Pack is, but one pack in, I don't know, every 12 boxes, I'm gonna guess. So we got the Ekans. Marowak, what's he doing worshiping the moon right there? We got Porygon. Oh, I really wanna see our first illustration rare. We got Weezing. And a Machep as our holo card. Okay, you got the back. There's also a really nice Snorlax illustration rare as well. But to be honest, that Mew or Charizard, like ridiculous ultra rare, that's what I'm gunning for. There's also a really nice Venusaur card too. Another card that's got a lot of hype around it. Are we checking? Are we checking the like Pokeballs? Everyone, I don't want to miss it. We got Psyduck. Hey, that's not too bad at all, Raichu. Okay, so we got the Master Ball you look out for. You've got the God Pack you gotta look out for. But another big one everyone's chasing is that golden Mew card, that full art gold Mew. Everybody wants that thing too. I remember when it got announced, it was like all over my Twitter feed. Abra. Ooh, regular Pokeball Vulpix. It's actually kind of exciting because I'm getting really excited over the reverses. A Jolteon as well. Then we got Sand Slash and a Tentacruel. There's not that many packs in each box, which is kind of sad, but I do have a second box. So if you're really pumped up for today's video, please demolish the like button because I want to do, if you guys are down for it. Go, oh! It's our very first one and it's a Psyduck. I actually really wanted this card. That's amazing. Look at him. He's like, Psy, Psy, Psy. He's running all the way down the steps. Tell me you want to see me open the whole set and collect it all before it comes out in English. I'm so down for that. So yeah, if this video gets 5,000 likes, I'm going to go buy a bunch of these boxes. Maybe I'll buy a whole case and we'll keep opening until I find a God Pack. Because you know what? I don't think I've actually got one on camera before. Star you. And then regular Pokeball. Hey, it's Mewtwo! I actually kind of enjoy that Mewtwo didn't get that much love in the set. It's more around Mew itself. Okay, so we're gonna Rattata now. Coughing. I reckon we're only gonna get one full of card per box, which worries me a bit, but we do have a second box. Master Ball? Nah. Okay. Hey, it's a Charizard on the first box! Okay, this is fantastic. All right, got a regular Charizard EX. I love that they're EXs as well. This is awesome. Okay. Charizard EX on my first flipping booster box. That's great. There we go. I'm sorry, got very overshadowed. Two packs remaining. And that Charizard EX is just a regular EX. We're still gonna get a texture card of some kind. Regular Pokeball Super and boom! Our full art is the Australian exclusive. I feel like we had to have done it, guys. It's the Kangaskhan EX. Just a simple blue, sky blue like background there. Little Kangaskhan jumping out the Joey. Are we still gonna get a hyper rare illustration rare? Like something ridiculous rare? Far fetched. No, that would be a nice one to get at the Master Ball though. I like the pattern. So Magma, you're looking good. And a Gengar. Oh, I know a few Gengar collectors that are gonna be excited over this. That artwork looks pretty cool. Wait, it's stretched out. Cloister and then an Ivysaur too. Oh man, this is gonna go way too fast. Maybe I should have bought more boxes. Oh well, if we're really that excited, which I am very pumped up, I'm gonna go buy a case and we'll hunt for the God Pack. 
Honida. I want to see what the Master Ball looks like. Okay, Vaporeon, Lapras. This is We're doing actually okay. We're doing all right. We've got a full art. We've got a Charizard. Let's see if we can't get another illustration. Okay, Gr imagine you got Grimer and that was your Master Ball pull. Ah, I knew Dragonite had to have a card. I was going to say, I don't know. I haven't memorized the card list too well, but I don't think Dragonite's got a full art. So there we go. It's got a holo card. Prime Ape, you go to the side there. Oh, we're getting down to the final couple, guys. Coughing, Psyduck, what's it going to be? Hey, this is great. Okay, Bulbasaur. I'll take that. Yeah, it's going to be the Bulbasaur. See what I mean? Like, this is where Pokemon cards are nowadays. The Pokemon is like this part of the card, and the rest is just gorgeous artwork, which I think is awesome. We're going to work out the ratios of these boxes by the end of it. Okay, that's Ando's uh, recess after he's finished with it. An Apple Core. I love it. I think I used to feed Apple Cores to... When I had rabbits or like, I can't figure out what pet was, but like my pets used to eat the apple cores. Goldeen as the regular Pokeball and a Weezing. Giovanni, of course, is going to make a comeback. And Doug Trio is like the fourth to last booster, by the way. Sandro, please tell me you're bringing out something good. Magma, hey, that's pretty good. Not the Master Ball, Charmander. Okay. <laughs> Are we going to get something else? Four remaining. I hope I haven't skipped the Master Ball. That worries me a bit. Zubat, Caterpie. <gasps> oh, that is awesome. Machop, Machoke, Machamp. We're going to get the whole evolution line. Oh, I love this. There's a Meowth there as well. Pidgeys. And there's the Removalist Company. It's got the logo with Machoke on there. Oh, 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 oh. What is it? What is it? It's a win. No way. A double hit with a Mew. That's awesome. That right there, that screams like how cool this set is. Recap's going to be sick. I'm also really excited to open the second box too. Okay, that thing looks like in Scooby-Doo, the movie, where they grab the souls out of people in the cave. Anyone else get that reference or just me? I watched Scooby-Doo last night. Okay, we got Magic Up, Weeping Bell, regular Pokeball, Omnistar, Scyther, and a Hitmonlee. Second to last booster. Everyone, come on. I need all your positive energy right. Hey, it's the Master Ball. We didn't miss it. That is sick. Okay, very obvious too. Got the M, got the two... Uh, Little lumps right there. Nah, it's going to be a Mr. Mime. Although the artwork looks quite nice there. Dude, sick. So, please, if you actually buy a box and you open it, just keep your eyes peeled for this, because I think this one's going to be worth so much more money than the other ones. Um, just obviously, because it's going to be way less, like, common. We've got the Onyx. Okay, one booster remaining. My theory of one full art card per box seems about right. I was hoping you'd get one full art in the regular... Uh, and then you get one full art in the illustration section. I have a bad feeling you're going to get, to get one full art. There's also a Pikachu illustration where I am dying for. Magic up! Hey, it's the Blastoise. Okay, let's open up our second box and have our fingers crossed we can get the Venusaur EX as well. And see what our full art card there is. Alrighty guys, I feel like we've had the warm up. I feel like we've really tested out how good our luck can be with one full art per box. And let's see if we can stretch it a bit further and get one god pack per box. That would be so cool. If I could get that in the first video, that would be pretty sick. And also getting a uh, Master Ball in one of the first couple of packs would be awesome as well. Okay, so we're already starting to double up on a few of the holo cards, which is pretty interesting. I'm curious like how many double ups we're gonna get because the set is still pretty big. For a Japanese set, being 165 cards in the regular set, plus all of the secret rares, still a very big, uh... oh my gosh, another double up on the Gengar. Still a very big set, considering there's only 151 Pokemon. But I guess it shows like how exciting and difficult I guess it's going to be to uh, try and complete as well. Bulbasaur! Hey, it's Dragonair! Oh, that's awesome! And there's this thing behind it. <gasps> Boom! Our full lot is a Venusaur! Oh, that is really, really awesome! Okay, we're going to double hit, by the way. Double cheeseburger. Probably one of the better ones you can get. Do you reckon that Golden Mew, considering we've already got the full lot, is the gold Mew card randomly inserted? Like, could we still pull it? And also, is the God Pack randomly inserted? Because, oh, double hit, another Mew. Maybe Mew is guaranteed per box because Mew's on the front of the booster packs. It's just a regular EX, but still very, very nice. But yeah, this set's like wild because you don't want to stop opening because normally you get the crazy one pull and you're like, you know what? That's going to be it for the Japanese box. With this one, at any moment... You could either get the Master Ball Reverse, which I forgot about just then, Beedrill and Snorlax, or you could just pull a God Pack. 
So at any moment, something could be popping out. Pikachu, shout out to my boy. No chonky chews in this puppy. Hey, Ninetales got an EX as well. I didn't know that. Ninetales comes back from the base set. I love it. Tentacruel and Kabuto. Now, the, uh, the sad part is, this is how quick you go through these boxes when you're, like, mowing through them. It's nice in the first box because you're really admiring the artwork. But then you're on a mission. Whoa, double up right there. Okay, got the Machamp twice. Heracross and Dog Trio. Third to last pack. Okay, Rattata. You're going to come through. Got the coughing. Oh my gosh, how many double ups are we getting there? Mr. Mime once again. Hitmonchan and a Krabby. Second to last. Sandshrew, Magnemite, Electabuzz, and a beautiful Nido King. Look at it in the jungle. Kind of looks like Christmas lights back here, but that's a vine. Is there something behind it? Hey, that's pretty good. Flareon's awesome. Let's keep it moving. Let's keep going. Okay, this is the final pack of the left. Oh, Vile Plume. Okay. And, oh no. I wonder if that gold is randomly inserted. And, any moment, we just pull it out. Boom, God Pack. Okay, Ekans. And then, Mewtwo again. Wow, we're getting a lot of... Oh, shout out to Kadabra. Any Kadabra card I'm going to cherish a lot, so... I could double up on him all day long. Volpix. And we got Star U. Not regular Pokeball. And a Gyarados. I met a lot of Gyarados fans while I was in the US. I never thought too much about Gyarados being like a very cool Pokemon, but holy smokes, a lot of people was like favorite Pokemon ever. Um, and I also met a few Magikarp fans too. <gasps> oh, Golem! I haven't met a Golem fan in real life, to say the least. Okay, beautiful Golem EX. The starry pattern kind of does work on these uh, original 151 Pokemon. I don't know why, it stands out a lot more. Maybe it's the artwork? Okay, Poliwag. Come on, we're gonna Voltorb. And we've got another flippin' <laughs> regular holo. Oh dear. Okay, put you to the side. <sighs> what do we got? Like five boosters remaining. Meowth, Charmander, and Nido Queen. Hmm, all right. Got a Bell Sprout, Growlithe, Electabuzz, Growlithe again with the reverse, and then we got the Jolteon as the Hollow. That's funny. This late looks like to me school photos. Come on, Raticate, get on top of the uh, little crate there and take your school photo. Smile! <laughs> it's kind of weird, I don't know. And a beautiful looking Charmeleon. This is kind of screaming to me how hard it is going to be to pull the Charizard um, Ultra Rare. Let alone all the other ones. Oh, Canopy! Has an art rare, really? That's so adorable. Star me too. That's a nice artwork. Gosh, I, I want to get another box. Okay, so we've got a Canopy as the illustration. Put you there. And we've got the Star me too. I like that artwork, actually. Bill, you go to the side of the Omnistar. Three packs to go. Zubat time. Let's go. Ghastly. Oh, another Lickitung. Oh, and a Venusaur regular EX. That's perfect. So we got all three starters, I think, now as regular EXs. We'll have a look on the recap at the end. Thank goodness I got two boxes. Open you up. Second to last pack. Seal, come on. Articuno. Hey, that's a nice... That sparkle on top of the Pokeball really stands out too. It's a nice Marowak. We got Articuno as the holo. And a Graveler. All right. The final booster of 151. What can we do right here? Oh, it's not looking good. Vulpix, Tangela, Pidgeotto. Hey, it's the Master Ball in the final pack. I swear they did that on purpose. We've got Lapras with the Master Ball pattern. You know what, guys? When you lay out all of the hits across the two boxes on the table here, you start to realize how awesome this set is. You just got to look at the EXs here where you see the Charizard EX. Next to the Blastoise EX. Next to our amazing Venusaur hits today. My favorites, though, it's the Machoke right here, helping her move into the home, or it's the Psyduck, just holding its head running down the staircase. Now, you also get the two Master Ball hits as well, which I'm pretty excited about, but you gotta let me know with a thumbs up. If this video gets 5,000 likes, I'm gonna buy an entire case of this and go hunting for a God Pack and try to find that alternate Art Mew and Charizard.